This is just a short video to demonstrate my MM switcher program which allows you to store up to five different MMSSTV configurations for use with different radios and or different sound cards. For example, I have here an FT450D with a G4ZLP Digimaster Pro interface. It's currently running on 6 metres. I've got a, an FT7900 dual band FM rig which has its own homebrew sound card interface that's currently on 144.5 and if I move across here you can see I've got a Yaesu FT840 which has got its line output uh, audio connection going to the line input on my PC's built-in sound card that's set to 14230 at the moment, the SSTV frequency on 20 metres. So I've already configured my um, MM switcher program to work with uh, those three uh, radios. Uh, the details for that would be in the help file that comes with the program. So if I want to select one of those, I just go to the top one, the FT450D, click on that. It closes fairly quickly and up comes uh, MMSSTV uh, configured for use of the 450D. There isn't any slow scan to demonstrate on 6 metres at the moment, uh, but um, I've just tuned into a, a little sproggy I've got there. You can see the uh, spectrum display changing as I wind up and down just to prove that the audio really is coming from the uh, FT450 as I vary the frequency, turn that one down. Now if I just quit MMSSTV, I run the switch program again. And this time I'll select the uh, little FT7900 for VHF. Click on that, and up comes uh, MMSSTV again. Sorry for the horrible camera work. Uh, if I just open the squelch on that rig, you can see that that's the one. You can probably hear the sound of uh, unsquelched FM. I'm sure you're all familiar with that. So that just proves that that's all configured for the 7900. I close that again. I go back to the switcher a third time. Select the um, FT840. As it says there, FT840 RX only. So they don't have any kind of transmit uh, configuration. And uh, oh, there's a signal coming in at the moment on uh, 20 metres, somewhat weak. In fact, it's just lost the squelch on that. But that's the, uh, the FT840. So I can easily select those three rigs as and when I need them. And the program allows you to uh, do the same thing for uh, up to five different uh, radios and or sound cards. There you go. There will be more details on my website in due course. So if you go to classicsstv.com, that's classicsstv, all one word, .com, and you should find some information on there in due course. Thanks for watching.